ओके सो हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे आवर टॉपिक इज द स्टेलाइजेशन एंड डिसइंफेक्शन सो व्हाट इज स्टेलाइजेशन स्टेलाइजेशन इज द रिमूवल ऑफ द ऑल द माइक्रोस प्लस स्पोर यू हैव टू रिमेंबर हियर दैट इज इट इज आल्सो इंक्लूड द स्पोर ओके यू कैन रिमेंबर बाय दिस एस फॉर स्पोर एंड डिसइंफेक्शन इज द रिमूवल ऑफ द ऑल द पैथोजेंस बट लीविंग बिहाइंड द नॉन पैथोजेंस एंड स्पोर दैट इज दे डू नॉट किल द स्पोर्स फ्रॉम अ नॉन लिविंग ऑब्जेक्ट सो Uh, this is the definition of the sterilization and disinfection. Now let's see the what types of sterilization process are there. So methods to activate achieve uh, sterilization and disinfection. So first one is physical and second one is chemical. Physicals are heat, physical heat, drying, radiation, sunlight, and filtration. Chemicals are halogenated compounds, aldehydes, phenolics. So let's start with heat. So here, let's see the physical agents. So physical agents first first is the sunlight. Sunlight reacts. Sunlight is used. Next is drying. So as eighty uh, percent of the bacterial cell weight is uh, of H two O. So if we dry H two will go away from the bacteria, and as a result H two has deleterious effect on microbes. So that is the drying. Now heat. Heat is of two type: dry heat and the moist heat. Dry heat kills by chewing, denaturation. of proteins oxidative damage and toxic effects so here you can remember a mnemonic here that is the c dot okay and kills uh, moist is the killing of the killing by denaturation coagulation of proteins okay so uh, this is the moist now a uh, moist and now the dry heat dry heat is of four types so first one is the flaming next is incineration next is red heat and last one is hot air oven so in flaming glass sides we we use flaming process in glass sides and mouth of test tubes next is incineration incineration it heating on 870 degrees celsius to 1200 degrees celsius done for anti anatomical and microbiological waste now is red heat it is bacteriological loops and the wears now hot air oven that is a glass petri dish we use a uh, hot air oven to uh, sterilize the glass petri dishes glass syringes glass powder sharp surgical instruments like a like scalpel and blades now moist heat moist heat uh, is of three types so first one is uh, less than 100 degrees celsius equal next one is uh, equal to 100 degrees celsius and the next one is greater than 100 degrees celsius less than 100 degrees celsius examples are pasteurization that is we used to do it in milk next is water bath and next is inspissation okay 100 degrees celsius is boiling steaming and tenderization and get at the 100 degrees autoclave so that is the moist heat now let's see the inspiration in details inspiration okay heating an article at 80 degree to 85 degrees celsius for 30 minutes in an inspirator for three consecutive days day 1 all the vegetative bacteria are killed next some germinated spores will be killed next remaining spores would have germinated will be and will be killed okay done for culture media containing serum and egg serum containing media like loafer serum slow and the egg containing is lorstein jensen media and dorset egg medium okay so that's it for inspiration now come to the radiation radiation is of two types first one we can do it by ionizing then that is by gamma rays and non ionizing like uv rays next is filtration filtration we use two types of filters that depth filters and membrane filters okay depth filters uh, we use three types of filters there it is candle filters asbestos filters and the sintic glass filters membrane filters made up of polymers and we use three mainly three let's see the example let's say cellular acetate cellulose nitrate polycarbonate and now uh, is here you can remember that filtration of air surgical mask hepa filters and evl pa filters next is chemical methods chemical methods first one is phenolics so disinfectants like lysol cresol and xylenol and antiseptics like chlorxylenol chlorhexidine and hexachloropin next one is halogenated compounds halogenated compounds is chloro chlorinated compounds and iodinated compounds chlorine it compounds are sodium hypochlorite calcium hypochlorite and chlorine dioxide and the iodine compound is tincture iodine next one is alcohols alcohol are ethyl alcohols and isopropyl alcohols aldehydes aldehyde formaldehyde glutaraldehyde ortho 
uh, orthoptaldehyde okay so that is for the all the process we have seen the all the process of sterilization so guys if you like this video then please do not forget to hit the like button and please do subscribe my channel